listening to other people when they talk because that's how conversations work. What? Oh, um, sorry. We just can't stop thinking about what we've become. It's clear that we're no longer human. But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? I mean, technically, I don't have any ears, no mouth. Christ, that's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. You're a robot, okay. Simon. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd Basically. probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. Or I'd kill myself. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cope? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and then go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omni tool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Uh, Kath, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh-huh, yeah, the warden unit, the WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. <laughs> it's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside data, okay? Okay. I mean, you should be happy that I even found you, or you even found me, because... To be honest, Catherine, you wouldn't be SHIT without me. I mean, okay, look, we're, we're, we're a duo, alright? But I'm just saying, you should be a little bit more fucking thankful. And a little less of a smart ass, you know? I carry you around. I could just wipe my ass with you right now. I really could. I really could, Catherine. I would give no fucks. But I need you. Strasky, wake up Dr. Masters. We're bringing in anchors. What's wrong? What can I say? He's had a rough day. Christ. He's all butchered by structure shrapnel. The lab sure did a number on him. Brandon, flip the panic switch on the sink. I don't want to burn through the oxygen. You're kidding, right? fucking hanging on by a thread. We need to move him. Strasky, get the infirmary ready. We need to move fast. Wait, where are Comoravia and the others? This is all we got. I guess it's still at Delta. Now, yeah, I can't do this on my own. Ground the other side. Strask, ready or not, we're coming in. All right, see you soon. Okay. So I guess that's how Acres was dying. Unless there's something over here. There's another buffer. This. This thing on? Can everyone hear me? Go ahead, Strom. Listen up, all members of staff. The art project has caused a lot of arguments the last few months. I'm not going to pretend I understand what the hell Sarang talked about and how his continuity suddenly made sense to kill yourself. <laughs> For the fucking love of God, or whatever you think is important, don't kill yourself. <laughs> this place is miserable enough. Don't force your friends to clean up your blood. Well Rest said. In peace. Quality. Well Good? said. I like that. Beautiful, sir. Beautiful. All right, everyone. Show's over. Get back to work. Couldn't have said it better myself. Don't fucking kill yourself. That's everything, right? Thank you, Catherine. Wait. What? Am I already here? Hello? Who is that? Mark? Do I look like a Mark? No, we haven't met before. Is this Mark? I think we're safe. Oh, I was so worried something had gone wrong. What's your name? Robin Bass. Theta Field Service Technician. Uh, nice to meet you, Robin. She thinks she's in the... How did you get here? I got scanned, like the others, and then I killed myself. At least I think so. What? I can't remember that part. How does that work? Did dying get you into the Ark? Wow, you're definitely not from Theta. Let me guess, Omicron? Wasn't sure Catherine would be able to scan you. Toronto. Guys. You're lucky. 
There was a lot of talk about this at Theta. The idea is, when you're activated in the Ark, there's basically two of you, right? One human, one living skin in the Ark. You don't want your copy to survive you. You yourself want to survive on the Ark. If the human you died before the scan is initiated, or closely after, you yourself would live on in the Ark. Amazing, right? Okay, so that's how it works. So, are we Simon, or are we... It said we're robots, so we're technically like these guys, right? Yeah, I don't either, but, uh, you know... I can't plug it back in. Uh, fuck. I just wanted to heal myself. God damn it. Uh, rest in peace, Robin. Oh, that's a big fucking door. I can figure this out. Okay. Fuck. I'm a fucking genius. I mean, it basically just gave me commands on how to open it, but whatever. <laughs> this looks like some pretty serious shit. We have two doors. Makes sense. Door number two. these dark places. Okay, let's turn on our light. Uh, swipe Mr. Omni Tool. Mrs. Omni Tool, since there's a female in there. What just happened? Okay. Big ass room is draining this fast? Holy shit! Technology. Tech fuckingology. The future. Another giant fucking load thing. Oh. You can do it, PS4! There you go. Open. There's light in here. Hello? Anyone there? Well, Catherine, we found Theta. We are at Theta now. And we're loading. Apparently Theta is a large place. Access denied. That's the first time our door opener didn't open a goddamn door! We have another thing that we can break here. Let's get this. And then... Pah! Anarchy! Alright. Nothing here. Let's swipe the thingy. Plug her in. Here? We're here. Yep. Okay, great. Time to hijack ourselves a submarine. There will be will be nothing stopping us when we have the dumb bat. You guys sure have a lot of machines and vehicles down here. What makes this one so special? That's it's a good the question. only transport that can go into the abyss without cracking like a can of soup. Oh. If this is one of a kind, then how did they get the ark down the abyss in the first place? That's a good question. 
I suppose they did it the hard way and just walked. Didn't realize that was an option. What? Kath, what's it like inside the Ark? Is it like a movie or virtual reality? No, of course not. It's, you know, like real life, but slightly better. Pleasant temperature, clean air, good weather. So people in the Ark just walk around pretending it's the real world? You don't have to pretend. It's perfectly immersive. And it can just sustain itself? Yes. Attached to a probe fueled by solar panels, it could survive for thousands of years. That's amazing. Just it is. thinking about the Earth being what it is and us setting out to save the final remains of humanity, it's... It's... Heroic. Uh, at least it feels I've, I feel like Kath is kind of insane. Here we go. The Dunbat. Uh, She's really big yeah, on getting through all of this. To be true. What's wrong? It's... It, it's quarantine. Like fucking everything else in this Hold goddamn on. game. Let's go do another puzzle, okay? We need a I already know what I gotta do. How bad is it? It's we don't write these things down type of bad. Maybe someone's still around who can tell us what it is. Hmm. Sure, let's go with that. No, there's I'll just never unlock anyone. the other doors for you so you can explore the station. Okay. We need to find someone who knows the cipher. It's the only way to fire up the Dunbat. Okay, cipher, cipher, cipher. Site status, theta, all systems, operation of. Fuck. Map. Main level. Okay, we are here. There is level one and then there's level two. Looks like all your friends moved downstairs. There's a lot of black box beacons. Staff. That's so strange. Holy fuck, there's a lot of people. Okay. So there's nothing to do there. I guess we hop out the window again? Let's open this now. Never mind. Let's turn the light on. Beautiful. Okay, well. I guess we can go in these now. I guess we can go in these now, right? Oh, fuck. fuck it, go. Go, go, go. We're okay. We're okay. I jumped a little bit. Don't worry about that flinch. It was an impulse. Why would they all leave this floor? I don't get it either. It's like they all just cleared out. Everybody cleared out. There's literally nothing left. Look at what a beautiful- <laughs> Oh, the lights, why are they so loud? Oh. Oh, they left their toothbrushes and everything here. Let's see if there's any bodies. Hello? Hello? Nothing here. Showers. Jesus. Whatever happened down there? Let's go up stand. Okay, no we can't. What's so interesting downstairs? Maybe the shuttle station. Should we go check? Rather not. Got a bad feeling about this. Stick figure, go. Don't know what the fuck that is. Some scientific shit. Oh, so this is Guy Conrad, I guess, unless he's just taking pictures of other people, which is honestly kind of ugh, honestly kind of creepy. Maybe they wanted to keep close to the shuttle station in case something went wrong. You're really stuck on that one. I'm just worried about my colleagues. Yeah, Maggie, Brandon Wan, Catherine Chun. Our Catherine? 
Hey, that's my room. You want me that to bring something? A souvenir? No, it's just memories. Oh, she worked out. I wonder if she, I wonder how many squats she's done. Guess we'll never know. I seriously doubt you'll find anything useful in there. Sure, Catherine. Sure. What's a little projector? Looks homemade. I was gonna call That's it a pencil my sharpener. That's attempted building of a Vivarium. It's kind of a proto arc. Don't care. Wait, what was the other thing? AR capsule. Richard gave me a set of AI templates I haven't seen before. Unfold them to make a new friend or uncapsule. Blah 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 blah. Okay. She's kind of in the weird stuff. You don't have to search my room. We'll get well, by. I'm gonna do it myself anyway. All right, deal with it. Seem like you're hiding something, Catherine. Hmm. I see you wear a beanie. That's cute. Some water. So uh, let's check your drawers here. You don't think I'm gonna find one of your dildos, right? I honestly thought that was a dildo. Okay. You have a lot of toys. Huh. huh. That's cute, Catherine. You know that? Was that a bra? Maybe we should move on. Maybe we should just keep these for a little bit. Don't don't be weird, Catherine. We'll just uh Are there panties in there? Probably not. Well, I'm just letting you know, Catherine, we're gonna be taking these along with us for a while, okay? I'm just gonna check these. I like how she doesn't say anything about it. There's nothing here. Nope, nothing. Not up. Oh. This guy's trying to figure out what wow is, I guess. This was before. Is there anything else? Anything? Oh. Nature of identity. Questions about the self. Who are you? What does it mean to be human? Does your body or your surroundings confine or define you? This is some deep thinking shit. Classified. Company is very pleased to hear about your success in making the new WoW station a station-wide presence. Uh, we must... Okay. So he basically just sucked the dick of the entire place. Alright, I don't give a shit about this guy's stuff. It's whatever. Mark Fisher. Oh. Oh. Black blood seeping. Nothing. 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 Man, this guy didn't have shit left. He fucking... He was out. Oh, fuck. We forgot Catherine's bra. Okay. What size is this? B? That's fine. Did a girl that had eight boobs. Boobs aren't everything. It's all about booty, remember? Where the fuck did it go? Oh. And this is a person we killed. Don't mind me, Robin. The other female that I betrayed. I just have, uh, Catherine's bra. Catherine, goddammit. So, I guess she... This is where she killed herself. Uh, yeah, Catherine, I'll just leave your bra and all the blood. what it looks like inside of the Ark. She just drew pictures of it. I guess I'd say that's what they designed it as, I guess. Can open that. Oh, fuck. That scared me. <laughs> Alright. Well, I guess... Oh, she's got the same hairbrush as you. And... I don't know what that is. We're all gonna die anyway. 
Oh god, okay, that's not peaceful at all. Well, I guess that's it for down here. It's just all information shit over here. Please don't make a noise. <laughs> oh, it does it every time. Okay, we're going up. Fucking hate that goddamn room. It's so nice when I came in there, but those lights, it just sounds like... Hello? Guys? It's a security camera. Welcome to my place. When I started the art project, I pretty much lived in this lab. Cozy. Oh, cool. It is cozy. Connection error. Checking for source. Error code, unable to maintain the mainframe. Please reset the router in the sub-level vault. Oh, fuck you. I ain't resetting shit. Fuck you, Comcast. Okay, so we can't use any of these computers unless we reset a router or some shit. This is where I would store the arc scans. So you saved the whole staff digitally on these chips? That was the plan. Cool. Damaged. They're damaged? Oh, that's not good. I actually be pissed if somebody took my brain scan or something and then they just broke it. Or some asshole like me just walked in <laughs> and just threw it somewhere. This is where I did my scan. And all the others, I suppose. You don't remember? My scan was the first. I had to test the scanner before I could start making promises. Okay. Connection error. Oh, uh, yeah. This is another computer that we can't access because of it. Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab. The scan room. What happened? Conrad killed himself after the scan. Jesus, how? A uh, maser tool? A maser tool. What should I do? I'm gonna need to tell Strohmeyer. No, please! I'm so close. Stormwire's gonna shut down the ARC project. It's not my fault people keep killing themselves. Catherine, what are you gonna do? It's not like you can sneak a 300 pound body out of the lab. It's a big boy. I know. Catherine, are you okay? Not even close. Catherine, huh? So Catherine's been around people that just kept killing themselves whenever they uh, entered this ARC shit. Or after they did their scan. I'm actually like... Honestly? Like, if you you were telling me I could live after I died, oh, I after this whole what? scan shit, Check I'd just go myself too. Just make sure. Check the terminal. Berg. Munchie. Munchie David compressed. Munchie. Yeah, David Munchie, our doctor. This... Nationality can- What is this? Jared. What? This is our yeah, file! What is this? Why do you have a file of me? You are one of Dr. Munchie's templates. A legacy scan. What? Audio recordings? Post scan. Okay, that's it. Wow. That was fun. That's a relief. I'm still figuring this out, so... It's freaky. So many lights. What do we do now? So we lived after the scan. We're gonna run tests for a week or so, and then we'll work out a roadmap to your recovery. Well, I feel excited. Can't wait to get back to the living. Yeah, so we survived after the scan. But we don't remember any of it. We've worked everything out. Everything is legal. Vouched for by Dr. Peak and Professor Wei. Oh, that's great news. No big change in medication. You'll be taking an aspirin every morning, but that's about it. Paul worked out a diet with some variations you should try out. You can continue doing physical therapy. Also, there's some extra cardio training every other day. Okay, getting complicated. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. Don't I'll worry, fuck all that. it's really not. We're going to keep an eye on you every week, so we'll be able to adjust the plan if needed. How comforting. Last recording. The model was sound. 
It should have worked. It's not your fault, David. I really wish things had turned out differently. Yeah, me too. I was supposed to save you. Hey, you got my brain on file. Maybe you can put it to some use. <laughs> yeah, who knows? You'd be okay with that? Using it for my research? Sure. It's like a part of me lives on or something. Like a donated organ. You know what sucks about dying? What? The crash. We died. Everything up till now. The brain damage. You guys, everything. It's made my life so much more real. I started thinking about all the things I was going to do. I'd never been more excited to be alive. All that hope. Wasted. That's fucking depressing. And that's the last thing we ever said on recording. Well, okay, this... Maybe this isn't the last, last recording. Maybe we didn't die on June 1st. Any self-respecting engineer wouldn't use legacies anymore, but they're grateful learning. They come with every development kit. So... My brain scan turned into a template for artificial intelligence. You should be proud. Cool. So much for that mystery. No magic or time travel needed. I was here all along. Waiting for someone to shove a picture of my brain into a suit and hit the power button. Okay. Well, that all makes sense now. So the original Simon Jared is dead. And now this is us. Stuck in a robot. I wish we could see ourselves. Do we ever get to see ourselves? Oh, okay, we've been in here. Yeah, so basically, we went to this thing, got this brain scan thing done, and he kept our shit on file after we died, and then we were used as a template for artificial intelligence, and now, I guess when we woke up, since it seemed like instantaneous the way that Catherine pops in and out of existence when we plug her in, it was the same thing with us. We just got plugged into Sorry. this robot. The last report filed by the staff mentioned struggling with something called a But proxy. who activated us? The proxy we killed was blind, just like Akers. Oh, no, 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 I'm not going in there. Careful, not the jump scare room. More by the infirmary. Okay, so now we have to go and get a... Not sure, it seems to be human enough to pass for a crew member. You have to go and find a router. Tall, dark, and ultimately faceless seems to be what to look out for. Keep my eyes open. Have to find a router. Oh, I don't like the looks of it down here. I don't know. Here we go. We're fucking dead. Oh, God. Yeah, auto save because I'm about to die in this motherfucker. I see it now. It's dead. Uh, I'm dead. It's over. Okay, that's not the way to go. can't talk to him or anything though he's just there dying is there nothing in here no router okay i guess of course it's going to be in the room where that thing is the thing just so happens to know where the router is and that we have to activate it Very, very quiet. Jason? Jason? Oh, fuck. It's a... Oh, I gotta pee. I have to... <gasps> oh! 
Oh no! 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 Turn around! Turn around! It, oh god, it looks like a fucking scrotum! Assassin's Creed type shit. Okay, so I believe there's only one thing. Oh fuck, there's a terminal thing. The router. Shit, where the fuck did it go? Pick this up. Throw it over there. Did it not see me? Did I really just sprint out of that entire- Oh god, we have to do it again. Go, 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 go! Reset router. Reset. We reset it, we reset it, we reset it, we reset it. Right? We did it, right? Please tell me we did it fucking right. Please, 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 please. Go back upstairs. Go back upstairs. Check the computer now. Or did we just shut it off? I don't know what the countdown thing was. I just glanced at it. Please tell me that shit reset. Good job, Simon. We did it? I'm not going down there again. Please tell me it worked. Okay, should, we should go in here first and check the um, the computers that we couldn't. Because we still have to find some sort of security cipher thingy. Or wait. Is it on the computer? Oh, well, okay. We'll check in here first. Uh, uh, okay, loud bang in 3, 2, 1. Bang! 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 No. Okay. The legacy scan of me that was on the computer. What did you use it for? It's a template that has an intelligence pathway already etched into the base. So if I wanted to build an AI, I wouldn't have to reinvent a whole model. Okay, we don't go this way. I would be able to focus on the things that the AI is to be used for. Is every AI self-aware? Do they also think they're Simon? What? No, Simon. Don't worry. It's not like we just put people into robots and machinery and let them run free. That'd be really cruel. It doesn't work like that. Or at least it didn't used to work like that. Truly sentient machines, thinking they are people, is definitely new. But you kept them sentient for the Ark. Yes, and I basically had to invent the method. Okay, so we did reset the router. Oh, okay. Fuck. Alright, so that... that... There had to be something on that computer, but it didn't look like it. We should really look for a scan. Check the storage. Scan project- insert a chip containing scan data. Uh... Is this one? An intact memory chip. If we're lucky, we might be able to extract the cipher from it. 
Okay, where do we put it in? Oh. It's like a Nintendo 64. There should be a list of people. See if there's anyone who could know a security cipher. Very promising. I'll just load them okay, up and get the works. simulator going. There we are. What are we doing exactly? We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. What? That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Take it easy, Mr. Wong. Chun? What happened to I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. It's okay. It's all a part of the scam. No, no, that, that's a lie. You're lying. Okay, calm down, Mr. Wong. No, 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 no. Oh, shit, he's shaking. Why, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, anything. Chun. I trusted you! Did we just bring that guy to life? I mean, he's a perfect scan, meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. And we turned him off. Took it all away again. I really thought that was gonna work. Maybe we can try again. Uh, sure. That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. What? You say the same thing? What happened? Where did everyone go? Mr. Wan. Chun? What happened to you? I, I Does can't go over the anything. same thing over and over again? There's nothing here. Don't worry, Mr. Wan. It'll all get better. No, no, that, that's a lie. You're lying. Don't get upset, Mr. Wan. No, 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 no. Well, why, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you. Yeah, no, we can't this do it. This setup won't work. We need something else. This guy won't work. There's no, there's no other chip, is there? Oh shit, what is this? What the fuck is this? Slot one chip. Oh shit. Oh, this is a simulation thing. Uh, let's put him on the beach. And now run it. That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. What? How did I get here? Don't be afraid, Mr. Wan. Dr. Chun, is that you? What happened? What is this place? Listen, I really need your help. I need the new security cipher. Dr. Chun? I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's no one here! It's empty. It's too empty. There's something really wrong with this place. It's not real! This isn't real! I have to get out of here! Fuck, man. Do we need to turn it off? Can we just keep him alive until we've got the cipher? The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So, what's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. Ski lodge, then. See if he likes a skill ski lodge. Oh, this that wasn't nice. so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. What? What is this? Where am I? Take a deep breath, Mr. Wan. Everything is fine. Dr. Chun? What the hell is this place? I don't have time to explain. I need you to give me the new security cipher. Why are you doing this? Is this some trick? I'm not giving you anything. I'm trying to save a lot of people. No, you're lying. This is all a lie. Look at this place. It's a fucking joke. Get me out of here, Chun, or I'll punch your teeth in! What the fuck? I think we need to build the scene so it's more what he'd expect. As soon as he starts to doubt, we've lost him. You're right, we need to think this through. We need some more data. What the f- How the fuck are we gonna do that? Oh my god, this shit is impossible. This shit... I don't even want to figure this shit out. You know what? Fuck that guy! I think I have an idea of what to do. So we take out this thing. Take this. Go over here to this computer that was offline. Plug it in here. Copying scan room to chip. Why would we want to put him in the scan room, though? Make him feel like maybe he hasn't done the, the scan yet? Scan room. Now run it. 
That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. What? Where did it... Alice? Mr. Wan, can you hear me? Chun? Where's Alice? She left. Mr. Wan, I need you to give me the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is a trick. Please calm down. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me, Wow. You hear me? You won't break me! Oh, for fuck's sake. How many times are we gonna have to do this? Come on, Simon. Don't give up now. Well, what the fuck? Here we go. Brandon Wan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. If we get to oh, okay. know him, maybe we can make the simulation a little smoother. If we get to know him, maybe we'll make the simulation in a little smoother. Here. Okay. Akers finally agreed to evacuate Delta. Brandon mentions a girl named Alice. They did their scans together. Alice Coster? We could try to make him think that she's there during the simulation. Might make him talk. Not sure how, though. Keep looking. Oh. That'll help. Brandon, you ready to <laughs> go? Fucking buffer. Mr. Omars, is it time to move? I'm waiting for Strasky and Alvaro to pack up their stuff. Head downstairs, and I'll meet you there. Don't take too long. Don't worry. We're right behind you. This is gonna be a long episode. I keep checking. I, think I just heard Alice talking to Brandon on the intercom. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. You got that from the intercom? Must be a transmission buffer. Hang on. Great. This is exactly what we need. I think we got this, Simon. I can synthesize Alice's voice from the intercom and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. Okay. We can now we got what we needed. Safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely feeling good about this. Good now we don't have to do it for the fucking 400th time. Good data mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. So it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. There we go. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. Well, that's what you get for listening to his stories. I guess I had it coming. About Stromar. He said he needed a new site for ASAP. What should I tell him? It's all right. I can talk to him. Wait. Didn't Sean just tell you to take it easy? Don't worry. I'm not going to tell anyone. I do feel hungover. Okay. It's 1729 over 42, 12 over 407. Got it? I'm not going to yeah, remember that. I'm sorry, Mr. Long. Brandon. Goodbye. No, wait. That's fucked up. That's enough. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. I just shut it down. I'm not erasing that shit. Alright, so now we go all the way back. Get back here. Oh. And we just go all the way back. And we finally, finally got through this fucking shit. I gotta go getting chased around by fucking scrotums and trying to figure out this code and that code and transferring data onto this shit. I didn't sign up for this. This is ridiculous. We learned that we're, we're, we're a robot. We're transformed, like, transferred in this shit. I can't. Oh, for fuck's sake. Now what? 